What's happening over there? It's nearly time. I'm glad you could make it. Are you with us? Queen Sveen has come to see you. is going to be all right. Bengal I gave to Namika. You know her? Of course I know her. She was like a mother to me. I see. She was always willing to lend a kindly ear to others, but rarely did she ever speak of herself. Is it... is it really you? She must have arrived shortly before the barrier manifested. For us it was perhaps days, but... for her... Namika, it's me! Wuklamat! I'm afraid her time with us is nearly at an end. she no more soul cells? She always used hers sparingly, but at her age, it wouldn't make a difference. Ma'am, the ushers have arrived. Thank you, Namika, for your many years of friendship. Take comfort in the knowledge that this is not the end. Be not afraid. Your memory will live on. Living on in memory? The giants share a similar belief. Wait, where are you taking her? Worry not. She is being escorted to a medical facility in the tower. There we will ease her burden. I had hoped to make arrangements for her sooner, but she wished to remain here for as long as possible. I could not bring myself to refuse her. Is there any way I might stay with her for a little while longer? We may not share the same blood, but she was my mother. Peace. Let us give them some time alone.
She didn't speak, but I'm grateful that I could be with her at the end. Thank you. It's not the end. Hmm? Oh, nothing. I was just thinking that we have much to discuss. Where shall we begin? With what we can be reasonably certain of, perhaps. Between what we have witnessed and the testimony of Alexandria's inhabitants, it's safe to say that two distinct lands have indeed become one. What's more, having met Namika, there is no denying the divergence in the passage of time. Taken together, these phenomena strongly suggest that some manner of cross-rift displacement has occurred. Specifically, the displacement of Alexandria from another reflection to the source. It does seem the most likely explanation. What perplexes me, however, is the scale of said displacement. It far exceeds what could conceivably be achieved with a void gate, or even with the Crystal Tower. In essence, we are dealing with a localized instance of dimensional compression. The Asians would no doubt liken it to a rejoining, which invites the question, how was such a feat accomplished? I wish that I had an answer for you, but this talk of reflections and dimensions is well beyond my understanding. I can only tell you that we lived peacefully under the barrier's protection for many, many years, until the day that peace was suddenly broken. If I may clarify, the barrier predates Alexandria's displacement. By several hundred years, yes, to when the continent we call home was ravaged by a devastating cataclysm. The barrier was erected to isolate us from the surrounding land's innocuous influence. I see. And it was only later that it was whisked away, along with its contents, by means unknown. In other words, Sphinx as lost as the rest of us, right? The Alexandrians didn't mean to end up in Tural. Ah, but of course, our next stop ought to be Everkeep. That tower over yonder. Once you have been registered as my guests, you will have access to Solution 9 and its residential district, where you will doubtless gain invaluable insight into Alexandria's state of affairs. Unfortunately, I cannot take you directly to where Zoralja resides. That you'd let us in it all goes a long way toward proving you're not content to let Zoralja do as he pleases. But we're not talking about a simple difference of opinion here. I've come to avenge my father, and to do so, I intend to take Zoroja's life. Are you willing to stand by and allow Alexandria's king to be slain?
is this? Aaronville! Uh, a trap? My darling, what now? laugh anywhere wait 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 since when was your mother a weird floating thing and what have we here say aren't you glue jaja's kid i knew i recognized that adorable fuzzy face <laughs> ellen espier was always so excited whenever you invited him over to play I can't say that I do, but you know my father? <sighs> Appearances notwithstanding, it would seem this is my mother, Kafkiwa. I'm sorry? is a little forewarning, but no. <sighs> Just when I thought I was starting to get a handle on this place, how are things still getting stranger? Thank you. 